Welcome to another episode. Mm. <laughs> We're off to a great start. Welcome to another. Welcome. Welcome to another episode of Rate or Roast My Rig. If you would like to submit your rig for rate and or roasting, feel free to send an email with a photo of your setup to rate or roast at gmail.com. Without further ado, let's get started, shall we? Wow, okay, a Selmer amp. I don't think we've ever had a Selmer amp on Rate or Roast My Rig. This is from the 60s. That's that's an old amp. Also, the, the Vox Phantom. I believe that's a Phantom 3 guitar. Also from the 1960s. Clearly, you like the Rolling Stones. And honestly, that's some Flintstones But nevertheless, I'm gonna give you four out of five beards. Um, immediately, my eye is drawn to your speaker cab that you maybe got at some sort of camping trip or logging trip, not really sure. Also your strap, my eye is drawn to your strap of your base. Is that from a jean jacket? I'm pretty sure that's from a jean jacket. How big was this jean jacket and all those pieces of flare? I don't, uh, boy. I do like the big muff and I do like the PV standard. So you know what? I'm still gonna give you, even though I shouldn't, I'm gonna give you a three out of five beards. I feel like I've seen this pedal board before. I'm actually, I know I've seen this pedal board before. I think it belongs to Tom Morello. Does Tom watch this show? The, oh wait, no, that's not the correct Dodd pedal. That's, it's close, but it's not totally correct. I feel like, and also Tom wouldn't uh, write Evil Empire on the top of his pedal board. I feel like, how does that, uh, how does the song go? I won't do what you tell me. I won't do what you tell me. Although you were like, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what uh, what he didn't tell me to do. And I'm gonna copy his pedal board. You know, it's slightly ironic that for a band that's known as spreading a message of non-conformance, you were like, I'm gonna copy that. Three out of five beards. Uh, this rig is simple yet effective and clearly you do many things, but this literally, the way you have it positioned, looks like it's a sound tank. <laughs> like it moves as one and you can either DJ weddings, you can either take the cover off of the Mesa Boogie 212 and blast some, some genty riffs with your Axe effects, or you can uh, unplug all that and just plug into your laptop and uh, play Kenny's G's greatest hits. It also might be a mini boss for uh, some kind of a wedding entrance or something. I'm not really sure, but you know what? I like it. I'm gonna give it four out of five beards. Okay, look, you're gonna get a high rating because of the dog, but you don't need the dog. You don't need to try to manipulate me. You have a great setup. The angle, the Jen ben, Jen's Ben's cab, the two guitars, the, the awesome pedals, the aux amp top box from Universal Audio. You know what, you have a great setup. You didn't need to put your dog in the picture, but I'm glad you did because I bet he is a good boy. But uh, nevertheless, I'm gonna give you five out of five beards. Oh, wow. Okay, right off the bat, my eye is drawn to the Bernie Les Paul Custom. Yeah, another Bernie brother, as I like to call us. I don't know if that's gonna be a thing, but uh, we'll see. Uh, I love the PVVTM, the Marshall. I wanna know about the robot you're building behind your rig. Are you so difficult and such a bad bandmate that you have to build a robot in order to have someone to play with you? Also, that sounded really terrible as well, but you know what? I'm still gonna go with it. And I'm gonna give your rig three out of five beards. Okay, this rig is prime example of clean and efficient. This rig is nasty and I love it. The, the Balaguer, the LTD, the 5150, the Mesa Cab, the pedal board's clean. It's tidy. You do need guitar stands, mister. But you know what? I'm feeling generous today, so I'm still gonna give you a rig four and a half out of five beards. This is a nice, clean room, and it's a little understated, but it's still present with all of the goodies. It's all there. You have the orange cab, you have the Randall head, you have the PV6505MH, you have the Keith Marrow signature guitar. Buddy of mine, love that guitar. It's an amazing guitar. You have the drum set, it's pretty cool. You also have a flag, and I believe that flag is from the Republic of Your Mom, which 
is a pretty known hotspot. It's very popular with a lot of people, but uh, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and still give your rig three out of five beards. That does it for this episode of Rate or Roast, my rig. Thank you to everyone who submitted a rig for rating and or roasting. And if you have your own rig to rate and or roast, feel free to submit an email to radioroast at gmail.com. And I will see you next time. Fluff out.